Hello everyone and welcome back to Brown Sugar. Today I have a treat for you. How are you all doing today on this beautiful blessed day? Thank you guys for coming and hanging out with me for another wig review. Um, I hope that you guys are they are going well especially let's just say the year right because we just got into the year so let's just say i hope your year is going well and all your new year's resolutions is going a-okay so far uh, today i have a wig review for us and the wig is called goodly afro wigs for women and i got it from amazon and i got it for about 22 dollars so it's affordable okay it is synthetic, but it's affordable. So it's not like overly priced like some other synthetic wigs. And um, the difference between this wig and my other uh, wigs are this wig has color. And you guys know that I usually do 1B or 1. This one has a little bit brown. So I'm just trying something new for the new year. So tell me what you think, if you like it or not, okay? So, ladies and gentlemen, this is the package that it came in. Uh, it just came just like this. It says Be for beauty and made in China. I received it just like this. So, let's open it up. And this is the beauty. I I'm going to try it out with bangs and without bangs. And we're going to see which one we like, okay? So, um, let's take off the net. Off of it, if it's still on here. Oh, the net came off already. And there it goes. So I got the net off. I have my stocking cup already on. So let's go for it. Let me pull this tag off. Okay. Pull it off. It's kind of lightweight. Okay. Not as light as the other wigs but it's lightweight. This is inside of the wig. Okay, they have one comb. So there goes one comb. And it has the, um, to keep the wig tight, it has two of those. But it doesn't have a comb in the back. So it's just one comb, I guess. Yeah, one comb. And then I'm just going to stick this in the last one because I don't want it to be too tight on my head. So I'm going to stick it in here. Okay. So it comes with one comb, guys. One comb. And that's in the front. Okay. So without further ado, let's try it on. It's kind of tight already. I might have to loose those things off. I might have to take this off because um, it's pretty tight on my head already. And I, you guys know already my head is not small. And I won't have to keep saying that, but yeah, it's too tight. I have to take it out, take that off. I just want it loose. Because you know how when wigs get tight on your head, it gives you headache and it, it doesn't feel well. So let's try it this way. Put the stocket cup on all the way. And then let's put it on. Let's try it again. Okay. Let's try it again. Stick this in there. And I guess we're gonna have to play with the curls. It's like Just um, take the curls and then separate them. That's all we're going to have to do it. Just separate the curls with our hands. And get it to the kind of thickness that we want it to be. Okay. 
okay so i'm gonna try this wig with i'm gonna try this wig with the bangs and without the bangs okay so um i'm gonna just take them and then separate it separate the curls i probably even need a um brush or a white teeth comb to comb it out that'll probably make a big difference too so how is it looking guys i think it's coming along different than usual but i could dig it So let me go and get a comb and I'll be right back to separate it some more, okay? Okay guys, so I got the comb and I got the brush, so let's see if I could puff it out some. Okay, it might not look like I'm doing much, but we're trying to create a puffy kind of look but this is the first look okay this is the first look that I have created someone said I look like Mindy that's what this <laughs> I look like a Mindy I don't know what y'all think I like it the curls are really bouncy really bouncy so this is the first look let's do the back let's show you the back of it of course oops this is the back and then maybe you just play around with it and then as the time goes by you will uh the curls could loosen out some and you could get it as wide as you want so if you want bangs this is the look for you Okay, so we're going to do without bangs. So I'm going to um, loose up the twist in front of my hair. And we're going to blend it in and see if we could have just like a puffy look rather than the bangs. Which the bangs is not bad. It doesn't look bad at all. But um, let's just try without the bangs. But guys, look at this. We could put some pins here. We could put some pins here, like how some curls hang in. Put it up to the side like this. Girl, that's cute. And you got you all, you all know you could put some bands around there, make it updo, make a pineapple. You could do different styles with this wig. I I could see it happening. I could clearly see this happening. So let's go ahead and do the other look with it going back. Okay, guys, I just did this look with the wig. I just used one bobby pin here and one bobby pin here and created this look. And it's pretty cool, too. It's a nice look also. Okay, so without further ado, I'm just going to take the pin out here, wrap the hair, take the other pin out here, see? And it's back to... Normal. So let's go ahead and undo the front of my hair and we're just going to blend it in the wig. And I just want to see if it's going to, well, let's put the wig on first. I just want to see if it's going to give me the puff look that I'm looking for. Okay. So we're going to undo it. Okay, guys. So let's go ahead and do our puff look. Okay. Let's see how that's going to go. Let's try to put this all up. Loose up the front. Because not all the time you would like hair on your uh, forehead, you know. So if this wig could look good, you know, in a puffy kind of look, that would be great news. That would be great news for us ladies. Okay. It's looking. 
looking good. I'm digging it. Loose up the twists. Guys, these twists in front over here, these flat twists, it blends every type of wig, okay? So this is not bad at all. I'm thinking I like this even better. So, guys, I'm thinking that this look is giving me Professor Milgram on power. Okay. Now, I kind of like this look a lot. I do. I like this look a lot, guys. Tell me what you think. This is cute. And all we have to do, of course, get your booster. Okay. Take some. Put it in the front. Like we do, always do. Put some in the front right here. Get your little brush. Brush it. Brush the next side. Oh, come on, guys. Come on, guys. This is, I like this better. I like it up. Tell me which way you like it. Do you like it with the bangs or do you like it up? Like a puff. I think I like it this way better. I know I do. I know I like it this way better, guys. You could see, okay? It blends real good. Ooh. I'm going to be having this on today. This is what I'm wearing today. Guys. So. You know, you can still use your comb to puff it up. Still use your comb. But I'm going to tell you this. Play around with the hair, with the unit until you figure out what you like. Play around with it. When you figure out what you like, then that's what you deal with, okay? Now, I could always wear it with the bangs and I could always wear it like this. I kind of like it like this with the hair away from my face, but you might like it different. Give it a shot. You all know that everything I do, I'm gonna put it in the description box. So I'm gonna link this wig in the description box. Remember, it's affordable. I think it's like $22. Um, it's called the Goodly Afro Wigs for Women. Okay. And so if you want to just try something new, give this one a shot. I recommend it because I, I don't usually do colors, but this color looks pretty decent on me. You can see that. Looks nice. Okay. Um, thank you all for coming and supporting me. Thank you guys for, you know, subscribing. Thank you for giving me thumbs up for commenting. I really appreciate it. Uh, you, you will never know. Okay. But, uh, this journey is just fun and different and I'm just enjoying every moment of it. Um, if you are new to my channel, welcome. And I hope you come back. And if you have been coming, thank you, thank you, and I thank you some more for your support again, okay? Until next time, stay blessed, okay? And safe. Bye.